Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to practically demonstrate using send keys command of actions class. So here you need to focus something guys. In this session, I am going to explain a command that is send keys command. Send keys command of which class? Actions class. Generally, we have another send keys command in Selenium WebDriver, guys. General send keys command belongs to the web element. Right? General send keys belongs to the web element. This is generally used here for typing the. We generally use this normal send keys command of the web element for typing the text into the text fields. This is the purpose. But here, this send case command doesn't belong to web element. It belongs to the actions class. What is the purpose of this, this send case command? The purpose is to simulate the keyboard key. The purpose of this send case command of actions class is to simulate the keyboard key pressing and releasing. That means if you want to press and release any key on your keyboard, let's say I want to press and release tab key, or if I want to press and release some enter key on my keyboard, for that we have to use this send keys command of actions class, not this one. Hope you understood this uh, theoretically. Now let me show you this send keys command of actions class in a practical way. In fact, I am going to show both the versions of the send keys command in the same session. Okay, I will be using the normal send keys for typing the text into the text fields. I will be using this send case command of this actions class for simulating the keyboard key pressing and releasing. For that, let me take an example, guys. For example, this omaya.blogspot.com web application is there. Here, somewhere at the bottom, we have this username field. Suppose I want to type some text into this text uh, username text box field. Which command I have to use? They have to use this send case version or this send case version. I have to use this version. This will be used for typing text into this text box fields. So. Let me parallelly show it uh, in a practical way. Here we already have some sal uh, Selenium automation code for opening the Chrome browser. Thereafter, uh, maximizing the browser. Then opening this application URL in the browser. Now I want to type text into this uh, username field. For that, we need to inspect this uh, username field, username text box field. And uh, this, it has some name attribute, guys. Uh, I'll copy the name attribute value. Go here and uh, type something like this driver dot find element by dot name by dot name guys by dot name and provide the name attribute value of the username text field. So this will return the web element that is nothing but the username field username text field for the most create local variable. So into this username field, I can say send keys of I'll type my name. Okay, I'll give the username as Arun. So Arun will be typed here, that's fine. Now, the next requirement on this web application is, I want to I want to press and release a tab key on my keyboard. Which send keys command I have to use, this one or this one? I want to press and release the, I want to simulate pressing the, and releasing the tab key. There's a key on your keyboard that is with the name tab. There's some keyboard key with the name tab guys. This I want to press and release. So for this, for pressing and releasing this tab key or any other key, we have to use this version of send keys, send keys of actions class, not this one, okay? We have to use send keys command of actions class for simulating the keyword, key pressing and releasing. Say for example, keyboard key is tab key. So what will happen when I press tab here after entering this uh, username into this text field, if I press tab, what will happen guys? the focus will go to the password field. You see, I am going to press tab key and release the tab key on my keyboard. What happened guys? Immediately after I press it and release the tab key, the focus went from the username text field to the password field, like this should happen. So let's uh, do that. But this send keys, this particular version of send keys belongs to the actions class. In order to call this uh, send keys command, we not to use the send keys command, we need to first create an object for this actions class. So let's create an object for the actions class. The next step is to press the, uh, press the tab key on my keyboard. So actions actions is equal to new actions like this we need to type. You need to create an object for the actions class first, over the mouse on actions and select import 
actions from selenium library and uh, this actions constructor cannot be empty so hover the mouse on this constructor it's asking you to pass web driver guys web driver object copy this web driver object and provide it here the error will be gone now use this object reference of actions class and call the method that is send keys this send keys we are we have to use so this is the send keys of the actions class not the web element here we have used the send keys of the web element for typing the text into the text field whereas here we are using the send keys command of the actions class for pressing the for simulating pressing and releasing a particular key so here i will say keys dot okay here i will say keys dot send keys keys dot which key we need to press tab key okay i'll be saying tab actions dot send keys keys dot tab some extra bracket came that's fine i removed it actions dot send keys keys dot tab this will simulate pressing and release the tab key but send keys command belongs to the actions class if for any command of the actions class to work we need to end that command with build dot perform guys this is a mandatory step if you don't provide this this command of the actions class is not going to work any command of the actions class to work actions class to work we need to end that command with build dot perform guys just remember that fine now this will press tab so when press tab the focus will come here as already explained now i want to type text into this password field now i want to type text into this password field so how to type the text guys which command we have to use this send case or this send case this time this send case for typing the text into the text field we need to use the send case command of the web element so which web element this particular password text field web element inspect this password field this is the html code of this uh, password text field it has it has some name attribute guys copy the name attribute value and create the web element here driver dot find element by dot name and provide the name name attribute value of the password text field so this will return the web element so i will name the web element as password field is equal to for the mouse create the local variable so it is a web element now if i say password field dot send keys so here i will give some password as my last name that's why i am giving some invalid credentials guys uh, no need to provide any valid credentials for this example so i assume since that uh, i am providing some invalid credentials just for this example guys we don't have to worry whether we have to give the proper valid credentials in this example so i am just simply giving some random credentials fine so this particular text will be entered into the password field like this after that again i want to press tab key on my keyboard i want to simply simulate pressing tab key and releasing it on my keyboard pressing and releasing the tab key on my keyboard for that which command we have to use this send case or this send case again this send case we have to use send case command of the actions class for simulating the keyboard pressing and releasing of a key say tab key so same thing you just copy paste guys actions dot send keys like this you can copy paste actions dot send keys of we'll simulate pressing the tab key so what will happen when you press the tab key the control will go to this login now i want to simulate pressing the enter key followed by this simulating uh, of entering the pressing the tab key i want to press the enter key simply say dot here instead of writing a separate statement you can continue the same statement guys send keys keys dot tab after that send keys keys dot enter key i want to press the enter key just to click on this login button if you press enter key on your keyboard i simply pressed and release the enter key on my keyboard guys what happened login got pressed after you press the tab key the focus will come to the login and at that position if you press enter key the login button will be pressed guys okay login button will be clicked by the keyboards keyboard keys so same thing i want to simulate so for that i have said send keys keys dot enter now at the end you have to say dot build dot perform that's fine so these two keys will be simulated and performed by this send keys command of the actions class you don't have to create the object again and again guys same object reference you have to use everywhere where you wherever you want to press the uh, press and release the keyboard keys you simply say actions dot send keys okay this object reference of the actions class just use it everywhere where you need to press and release the keys so this this is what we have to uh, write the code for guys uh, this code will actually enter the username and uh, then press tab key using the send keys command of the actions 
then again enter the password again press the tab key and release using the send keys of the actions class again press and release the enter key using the send keys command of the actions class so this should do our job i am not using the click command of the web driver for clicking the login button rather i am using the send keys command for pressing the enter key sometimes we can press enter key to login guys no need to uh, every time click on the login button you see it has entered the email address uh, i mean username then press simulated pressing the tab key it went to the password it's uh, entered the password it simulated uh, pressing and releasing the tab key then focus went to the login after that it simulated pressing the login key using the enter button by pressing the enter key and releasing using the send keys command it has pressed the login button also and we got this error password dot username because we gave invalid credentials so hope guys uh, you understood uh, how to use the send keys command of actions class in this session so that's it guys thank you bye